That's Clementine's hat. Shit! Put your guns down. I ain't going back. You tell him Jolene ain't going back. Hey, we had a deal. No shooting as long as we gave you food. What the fuck happened? You had a deal with them. I ain't them. Oh, I know you. I know what you are. And I know what you do. You don't know me. Steal my shit. Steal everything from me. We had a deal. You people broke it first. Who the fuck are you? What? <laughs> Look, you guys aren't answering any questions, you just... You gotta come back to the dairy. <laughs> oh, it's a hell of a lot safer up here. That girl there. looks crazy as hell, Maybe man. You didn't hear me last that time. hair. I asked you, sweet. Put your damn guns down. You think I won't kill you? I'm gonna take this here crossbow and put a nice sharp arrow right through your eyeball. And into your goddamn brain. You're not men. You're monsters. All men are monsters. Take what they want and then destroy it all. Take a can of beans. Take a little girl. It's all the fucking same to you. Where did you get this hat? The little girl. You stole it from her. So what if I did? You stole her from me. What? What the hell are you talking about? You know what? I changed my mind. I'm putting this arrow right through your balls. Yeah, right through. String them up on that tree. Then I'm gonna head down to that farm and shoot every goddamn person I see. Look, there's two of us and one of you. No matter what happens, one of us is gonna kill you. Like you could kill me. Don't be dumb. They couldn't kill me. They tried. Killing everyone. Take all this the This chick is insane. We'll make more. Go on. Tell him, boy. Tell him what you got in mind for us. Oh. I wasn't gonna shoot her. Hey, he popped the shit yeah, out of her. <laughs> well, thanks. I guess. Well, you're welcome. I guess. You notice my suspicion? See, I don't know what the fucking hell they're gonna say when I hit the button. It's a clean shot, though. Right through the forehead. That's good shooting right there. Still, what a waste. So, that's it. We going back? If they ain't here, I don't know where they are. And it ain't a good idea to go tromping through the woods looking for them. So yeah, we head back. Once they see this, they'll get the message. Get the crossbow. Just saying. There you go. Come on. Smart man. It's bulky, but it's another weapon. I'm going to try and set up camp. Do 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 do. Man, that was a hell of a ride, huh? Jesus, Danny. What? You ain't getting soft on Maria. Not after what they did to your friend. Is it about to start What happened? Handled it, Mama. Woo! Look at them thighs. This isn't what Terry Got them big old thighs, ain't you? My husband. Who's Terry? Missing every day. Been screwed up for everybody, oh. then, boy, don't you? Oh, calm down, princess. I'll do she it myself. She flipped him off. Those Going two, man. I'm getting tired of them. Like Not to smack Kenny outside his head huh? and punch freaking Lily in her tit. They have different ideas about how we should run our group. If they don't find any common ground, this whole thing's gonna fall apart. Punch no, her right in her boob. You punch Everyone's me in the boob. Hungry, and people get a little stir crazy when their tummy's empty. And Lee, don't worry your head about them bandits. I'm sorry you've seen more violence than I'd have thought in your short time, but you all are safe here. Don't worry. I think I'll go have a look around. Don't wander too far. 
dinner will be ready before you know Are it. you that guy that was Thank talking about Pac-Man earlier? No, that guy was an ass. Oh, man, I don't know. I should watch that movie. I watch that movie like every week though. I'm... I don't know. I haven't watched it this week yet, so I get... Oh, Clem! What are you... What are you doing in there? I'm gonna give you your hat back. You better not be touching yourself in there, Clementine. Clementine! You open that barn door right this instant. I'm gonna punch you in the boob. It's like my new threat now. I should... <laughs> I shouldn't have gotten on that damn... Hold on. Lily! Lily! I think I think Clementine's touching herself. I need you to talk to her. She's gonna be your daughter someday too. Hey, so what happened at the camp? Did you guys find any more of those guys that hurt Mark? Why is she so pissed at Kenny, but then when Lee comes around her voice gets shot? We found a woman in the woods. She was talking all crazy, had a crossbow, so Danny killed her. Holy shit. Was she one of those bandits? I'm honest. I don't know. I think she was trying to tell me something, but then... Where's the option to ask about... I like this, Lee. To ask her to tell Lily or motoring, Clementine about the changes going on in her body. How old is she? She's in, like, first grade, isn't she? Maybe, um... What were you and Kenny arguing about what when she, I came back What will she remember? He's losing it, Lee. That I told he her the truth? He comes over and starts talking about searching the barn and that these people are hiding something. But you told him to they probably are. business, right? We are guests here. We don't need to be overstaying our welcome more than we already are. It's probably a good idea, actually. The way I see actually. it, we just need to skip the dinner and get our food to go. But I'm starting to think your friend over there has another agenda. This is getting real bad real fast. What makes you say that? What exactly happened at the camp? Uh, it's nothing. Now, don't worry about it. Paranoia just getting to me a little bit. I know what you mean. These backwoods people always give me creeps. If you ask I burped, me, I'm we sorry just about get that. our dinner and leave. Come on now. We don't you said that room. already. I'm gonna go check things out. Just don't get too nosy. These kinds of people are usually pretty protective of their privacy. Ah, uh, yeah, I'm gonna let them do what they do. And is it? Look, it sounds like it's raining either outside my house or in this game, and I can't figure out what. What's that? What the fuck? What is that out there? Like that on hand must be great. We're gonna need to learn how to maintain it if we end up staying here. And killing the family. I mean, I'm trying to have everyone's back, but no one wants to let me have their back. Clementine, what are you doing in here? You better not be looking at Duck's thing. I'll slap you upside your head. Oh, you're just looking at the cow. You better not touch its udders either. It's okay, That's Clementine. something for big you girls. Okay. You cannot be eight years old and touching no cow udders. I like that shirt they gave Whoa. it. Katya says Mabel could have a baby tonight. We'll see, Clementine. <gasps> salt lick! What's this thing? They said it's called a salt lick. Yeah, but don't lick it. Yeah, it's you gross. dumb shit. Did you lick? Oh, come on, Clement. I don't know. <laughs> See, this is why I love Clementine. She's so goddamn silly. She's like, oh, uh, maybe. How you ain't gonna know if you lick something, Clementine? Come on. How you ain't gonna know if you lick something? That's just the epitome of grammar. Are you ain't gonna I'm gonna talk to the cow. Looks skinny. Fuck that cow. Hey there, Andy. Yeah. We met this woman up in the woods. She seemed to know your brother. Uh, yeah, he uh, he probably talks a little more than y'all. <laughs> well, that's all I'm gonna ask about that. Hungry, huh? I wanna Don't know worry. what's going on, but I'm you know cooking what? up some good grub. 
Look at Doc. Like He's that. like, yeah. Well, better now we got Doc on the case. Doc. Thanks. Yep. You better quit hitting on Kenny's wife. If anybody's gonna hit on Kenny's wife, it's gonna be me. Lee. Lee Everett. Have I missed anything? No. Brett Favre. Not really. Mm, it's mostly here. Well, you see, here's a guy who, like who, who, when he's around That's the cow. Duty. <gasps> Duty. Kids. What if I would have said shit earlier? Would she have been like shit? Duty. <laughs> How do you like that cow, Clint? I'm not going to give you your She's cow back, hat back yet. Oh. Okay, you can have your hat back. My hat! You found it! I knew you'd find it! You said you would! Listen, did you give your hat to anyone? No. Did you see any strangers around the motor inn who might have taken it? No. Why? It's probably nothing. Just let me know if you ever see anything like that. Okay, I will. Hey, Lee. Do you think you'll ever have kids? I'd like to someday. Maybe a little girl like you. That's nice. You'd be a good daddy. Well, thanks for finding my hat. You're welcome. I'll be your daddy. Do you want to pet the cow with me? Nah, but you go on ahead. <laughs> oh. How do you She's like just that so cow, adorable. Claire? She's pretty. She's pretty. Okay, I guess I'm done in this barn now that I've given Clement, Clementine her hat and made sure she wasn't doing things she shouldn't be doing. Why did it look like eight times darker in that barn than it does out here? <laughs> so, hey, you how does a woman well, like yourself run this whole place? Oh, I'm I see how it is. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, look at you, old man. You know what? I ain't even mad at you. As Tupac Shakur would say. Rest in peace, Tupac Shakur. Everybody misses you. I'm gonna stop quoting things. People are gonna be like, You're you don't have any of your own original lines and I'm like, Are you kidding me right now? And plenty of my own original lines. It's a small toolbox. Like no, oh, you you say like this nice like Marcus system. Phoenix. And that's Marcus Phoenix's line. And I'm like, yeah, Marcus Phoenix isn't a real person. If I knew who the voice actor was, I'd be like, he's the person who shut there. But I don't have a clue. Not like I really care. Not like I wrote. Whoa, who's this? Is that Shaggy? Or is that Danny? Hold or on. Billy Bob Thornton? I mean, oh, I'm Billy Bob I Thornton. My girl here. Wow. You really like that girl. What's not to like? <laughs> Dude, you're freaked out. Not much, I guess. Exactly. Dude. Hey. There was no one. Pretty out in the sticks. Here. You know what, Danny? I'm gonna Fine. slice you in half, you buddy. Any visitors? Not anymore. Bandits, of course. You're freaking me out now. You're starting to act like that crazy chick that we just ran into. How do you run this? Your hair even kind of looks like hers. Used to have more. They get hungry too, or sick. Got your doctor friend here now, though. You guys must trade for a lot of fuel to keep the generators running, right? People get hungry, and a few loaves of bread. Corn oil. Y'all are luckier on this side of the deal now. I'm gonna go wait for supper. Then. It'll be a good one. Is it human? Soylent Green is people! All fixed. That should make everyone happy. Soylent Green's not people. They made that up. It's actually... something else. We'll, uh... We'll finish talking it's later. Grass and soil. Soylent. You've been getting along with You're her. You're swimming. <laughs> He's just a big old sweetheart, ain't he? Uh, don't know Aww. if I would have used those words exactly. 
Don't judge, honey. This world is bringing out the worst in people. But if you really look, you'll catch a glimpse of humanity every now and then. Oh, you're just such a sweet old lady. Why are you out here instead of cooking? <laughs> oh, my boys get so much as a scratch and start hollering. He can definitely teach them a thing or two about being tough. I'd still like to check on him. You're gonna have to trust me on this, Lee. I've helped stitch my share of wounds. I know what I'm talking about. Why are you out here? You know what? I'm not even gonna ask her that because she's gonna kick me out. She's like, was that a kitchen joke? And then Larry's gonna punch me in the face again. Before she died, we met a woman out there at her camp. She wasn't one of those bandits. Sounded like they did something pretty bad to her. And your marauders are still out there. I think all them folks out the woods had drug problems. What does that have to do with anything? She did look like she was you drugged out. Trust him. Any of them. Think I'll go have a look around. Kinda peaceful out here, ain't it? Enjoy it while you can. You'll probably start hearing those monsters frying against the fence before too long. Alrighty. Alrighty, Rue. That was a terrible time to use that word for the first time ever. What keeps happening? What am I trying to do now? Um, I'm gonna go play with stuff. Is that a mailbox? Can I touch that? Give me that mailbox. No mail coming in or out. Give me the mailbox. At least they don't have to worry about bill collectors anymore. I could beat a zombie to death with a, a walker to death with a mailbox. I could beat it up with a female box too. This thing themselves. <laughs> uh huh. Um. I don't know what to do now. There, no one's like telling me. Actually, did she say go do something, or am I tripping? Am I, oh, talk to Larry. Couldn't talk to him before. That's what I was my next course of action, so I guess I'm kind of getting close to right. There's a boy here. So now, now I'm quoting Brennell like Floss. You kidding me right now? Pretty well. <laughs> you know, for a nice change of pace, how about you try and mind in your own fucking business? <laughs> 